first an email this morning from a gentleman uh, up in New Jersey who's got a bad shoulder injury and remembers years ago I did a video on the back cast, especially if you've got an injury. At that particular time, I had a badly injured right shoulder and it took me a year to get over it. But I was able to fish because I was able to do the back cast, which was taught to me by an awesome back caster called Dave Vickery. A good back caster will compete easy with pendulum casters. You know, it's a very efficient long distance cast. Okay, to do this cast properly, we need to have a rod that we can have a low reel seat and possibly an upper reel seat as well. You can do wow. this by having an adjustable, which is ideal. This would be normal casting. When you're back casting, you bring that reel down in about 10 inches from the butt and you'd go over your shoulder. If you're right-handed and you've got good shoulders, it's the upper, what, what's your upper arm now has to become your lower arm. And you would throw towards your upper arm. So it'd be over there. The person we were talking to has got, a, I believe he's got a right shoulder injury. So that's the hand that needs to be in a low position. Because then it does no effort, that shoulder never gets involved and you can cast a real long distance. If it was the other way on, left arm injury, that's gonna come here, and he would throw towards his long arm over here, all right? No, no injury where you can't use this left hand in that low position that I know of. It's not gonna hurt him at all. The long arm, the long arm is where it's gonna throw. Points to remember, when you're doing the cards, So I'm going to demonstrate the back cast, which is ideal for anyone who's suffering from any shoulder injury, because when you've got an injury, this can eliminate use of the shoulder and you can still get a very powerful cast. A back cast properly done by someone like Dave Vickery. I've seen him win tournaments against all the best pendulum casters there are. So it's a very powerful cast. The history of the cast, it was developed by farmers in Suffolk and Norfolk. They would have a pitchfork, they'd put their bait, and they'd lay their line out on the beach, and they would use the pitchfork like so. They'd pick the loop up for the bait, and then holding this here, they would throw it over their shoulder, and off it'd go, and that's how they used to fish for cod on them North Sea beaches. But anyhow, I'm gonna show you this cast, and it's really good if you've got an injury. The trick is, the injured arm is going to the low reel. Okay, so it's here for the right shoulder. If I was a left shoulder injury, I would be here. Okay? So I'm gonna just back away so I don't hurt you. Super powerful cast. You can get some great distance and it's an easy cast to actually learn. So what you do, stand the rod up, swing it out, swing it back. Well, if you've got a shoulder injury, this is the cast for you. I'm gonna do it in slow motion now. Thanks for watching, mate, I hope it helps. It is a great cast and very easy to learn, the back cast. And thank you, for Dave Vickery, Showing it to me in the first place. It's so easy, so easy to get comfy in Corpus Christi. Same for sale sign that I saw yesterday in the day.
please like, share and subscribe. We do appreciate it. And again, thanks for watching.